start off here. Uh, okay. This is the Mammoth 98 inch QLED 8K that we just announced on Monday. Um, so, as you can probably guess, uh, 8K is a double in 4K. Um, There's not a whole lot of 8K content out there right now, but what's the other advantage about this TV is that it won't scale 4K. So, it's right. going to be close to even if it is. So, they did talk about that last year. I'm civilized. Yeah. You know? <laughs> Another cool feature that the Sierra TV now 
was featured on our QLED TVs. Um, what it does is, say you have a wall-mounted TV, you can use your Samsung Surroundings app. You can take a picture of the TV as it's hanging up on the wall. It will detect the wallpaper or the color of the wall right. behind it, and then it'll throw yeah. it up onto the TV so the TV blends into your wall. Not right, they showed that last system. year with, yeah. uh, I think they called it the wall. Yeah. They, well, it's on, it's on, on the QLED TVs, but it's um, it on the ambient. Okay. Yeah. We'll get to the wall in a second. Oh, they, yeah. That's the micro LED thing, right? Yeah. 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 Okay. Exactly. So here we're getting into our connected living area. Uh, we've been with family up yeah. here. Okay. Uh, what's cool about this year is that it is, um, it's got a camera inside. It simulates a dry cleaning experience. I feel it's better because it doesn't use any chemicals. It only uses a filtration system that deodorizes. But in four simple steps, it uses gentle steam to deodorize and sanitize the garments you throw in there. Through smart things, you can actually control a lot of that, like what you throw in there, like if it's denim, if it's leather, if it's a dress, if it's a skirt. Um, so there's a lot of customization, and it's actually cool. controlled through Bixby as well. So it all ties back into our smart things ecosystem. Very cool. cool. Some accessories that you can throw, like uh, I always say. When you want to typically suit, you got a pocket square and a tie. You obviously fold that a certain way, and you obviously do it not a certain way. Go in here, reset it for the next time you wear your suit. Nice. That's super cool. yeah. That's and, cool. and, and just from a consumer standpoint as well, or a, or a B2B standpoint, uh, it only requires a 110 plug. And all it requires oh, really? from a, from a, from a, from a, there's no plumbing supply. You don't have to look at a water line up there. You just fill up the water reservoir. Awesome. So it's a plug and play. Nice. Thanks, man. Nice, nice. Why do they sell in the US though? <laughs> Great question. I know. I, know. <laughs> um, I hate it. I hate it. Go, here's all this cool stuff we make. You can't buy it. Yeah. Now we're coming to the wall. Ah, yes. So you were at CES last year. I feel like I the imagine. wall was smaller last year. So last year we announced the 146 inch. Uh, right. This year we've announced the 219 inch. Wow. wow.
get it back up to 40 percent or we can get it back completely so if i make it flush let's remove all of the clutter let's go ahead and open up some space but what are we missing we're missing wires that's right because we thought about that as well so now all of your wiring is inside the monitor so now all of your connectivity is going to be inside in terms of any usb to c or data it's going to be a seamless design one unit so if you move it you're going to move it in this entirely all the way down to the base there's a clamp the clamp now enables you the mobility to move it in your own personal space or business, literally around and clamp it to wherever you want it to be. The monitor itself, the monitor is literally going to have a multi-screen of up to six. It's also going to have picture in picture. The 4K, there's going to be one option. The other option is going to be a 27 inch. The 27 inch isn't going to be a 4K, but it will be a 1440 and I have a refresh of 144. So if anyone on the team is interested in gaming, that would be the unit to use for gaming because of its capabilities. Now, the next question is, is it available? It is actually available at our show. This has been the hottest item. We have it available right now on our site, samsung.com, Best Buy, or Amazon as a pre-order. Now, the next question is, what's that magical price? Okay, so my 4K32 <laughs> is gonna be 499, and the 27 inch is gonna be 399, and it's available for pre-orders right now. Once you pre-order and go online, it should give you an anticipated date of a life. So now everybody can take back their space. That's awesome. That guy's quite the salesman. <laughs> I want to see the PCs. The notebook? Uh, uh, yeah. The phones, there's no, no new phones, right? We do have new PCs. Here they are over right here, the new notebooks. Chromebook Plus. The notebook flash right there. Okay. This is, oh, this is interesting. What is, what is this made out of? So this is plastic and fabric particles. Oh, okay. It does not feel like plastic, that's interesting. You won't see the fingerprints. Yeah, it has the that's an interesting material, like it's a unique material. material. Yeah. And this is a uh, Intel Van processor. Cool. Yeah. What else? Chrome yeah. Plus, Y Series, Chromebook oh, Odyssey. Oh, that's cool, this is the new gaming one. Yeah. Nice looking trackpad there, that's cool. Nice. Oh. So this device is here. We have our speaker. 
Oh yeah, uh, when's that shipping again? Uh, not announced yet. Oh, okay. It's not announced yet. <laughs> Anticipate them taking over the worlds? Absolutely. 